Thank you for tuning in again. Today I'm going to talk to you about RMM or Remote Management and Monitoring. Uh, remote Management and Monitoring is essentially a, a small piece of software uh, that will be loaded on uh, your computer and servers uh, or uh, for network devices uh, monitored through uh, SNMP. Uh, and basically uh, there are monitors put in place for things like system resources, that is uh, system load, um, hard drive usage, uh, RAM usage, uh, so system state uh, of, of the backups, uh, uh, various things of this nature. Uh, when uh, the uh, monitors are put in place, a threshold is programmed, and once that threshold is met, uh, an alert will be triggered and our NOC or network, network operating center will be notified. Once that happens, a technician will investigate uh, the alert and uh, notify you if necessary, but uh, in all cases, we'll take immediate action to remedy uh, the issue. Um, some of the examples of uh, things that uh, we monitor uh, include um, server or workstation availability. In other words, if something goes down, uh, we'll be notified pretty immediately. Uh, service availability, so if you're hosting any kind of services, for example, Microsoft Exchange for your mail, or a website, or a line of business applications that run as a service, uh, all of these things can be monitored for their availability, and if uh, they uh, fail to respond to the monitor, uh, once again, uh, an alert will be triggered, our, our knock will be alerted, and then we'll uh, get the uh, problem fixed. Uh, disk health is monitored that way uh, we can be notified prior to uh, a drive uh, dying uh, and uh, can be proactive in the approach there. Uh, RAM usage, so if uh, uh, an alert is triggered there we can remedy uh, the issue by perhaps recycling an app pool for a web app or um, uh, restarting a service or uh, if this is something that recurs on a regular basis, perhaps we'd uh, increase the amount of RAM in a, a server or workstation. Um, processor load and uh, system load, uh, once again, if these things are habitual, then we may want to make some adjustments uh, to the uh, size of the processor or add an additional processor or uh, in extreme circumstances may even do a migration to a new machine or server. Uh, if those are things that are habitually uh, alerting. Um, We'll also monitor things like security updates so that we know that your systems are patched and have the latest security updates and uh, operating system updates applied to them to keep them uh, secure, keep your data safe. Uh, website availability can also be monitored because uh, as uh, many of you may know, uh, if your website's always going down, uh, it makes, makes you look bad and uh, also uh, the search engines don't like it when your uh, website isn't uh, available. Uh, 100% of the time or nearly 100% of the time. So we can be alerted to that when that happens um, uh, as well. Um, to get more information about remote management and monitoring, uh, we'd certainly like to talk to you to uh, tell you what we can offer. We uh, typically provide uh, RMM services in the Addison, Texas and Dallas, Texas area. However, we can uh, provide RMM services across the, the U.S., uh, but uh, on-call, once again, on-call uh, and on-site services are limited to the uh, Dallas area, although we are partnered with a number of different IT firms across the U.S. and uh, can provide uh, on-call services uh, uh, through our partners in that regard. Uh, please visit us uh, for more information at www.mdhtech.com. Thank you.